winter weather advisory is in effect for parts of our area. Here's a live look outside right now. We've seen some flurries come and go downtown all afternoon and evening. Not enough for a snowball fight, right, Mary Kay? Not at all, but definitely the roads are slick overnight, Rob, because we have scattered snow showers mixed in with spotty freezing drizzle. So those overpasses and bridges are the elevated surfaces really are getting pretty slick as they ice over. We've had reports of several accidents coming in, especially far to the west in LaSalle County. But as we look live right now, we have cloudy skies, a light flurry over Midway, a 23 degree feels like temperature. The actual temperature is 30 right now. The winter weather advisory has been expanded now to the east to include Kankakee County. So everything here you see on the Illinois side expires at midnight. But in northwest Indiana, as we step into Newton and Jasper County, that's in effect until three in the morning because of the progression of this snow system that's moving from the west to the east. Again, it's very light activity and it is mixed with a little bit of freezing drizzle that's not even showing up on radar because it's so close to the surface. So from Aurora to Joliet to Kankakee, that's where we're seeing now the best coverage of this snow. These brighter white returns in Will County, that really shows us the best coverage of snow now pulling through Shanahan and moving to the east toward Manhattan and New Lenox, Joliet. So all of this is going to be increasing for you as this band moves to the east. So future cast calls for scattered snow showers to continue through the night with low temperatures dipping into the middle 20s. Now tomorrow we should be mostly dry but also mostly cloudy much of the day until we get into the evening hours. So it looks like 33 degrees may be it for our high temperature in the city. Now as we move the snow through overnight again not amounting to much at all. It's just going to be icing over those roadways through the early morning hours. So tomorrow 30s Thursday 30s. I'm looking at a snow system on Thursday and the track of it looks like it may stay to the north of us. So we get the clouds from it tomorrow and then the snow band moves through and in the morning it could brush through Chicago. But the bigger story from this front is going to be the way it's opening the door for a much colder air mass to start the weekend on Friday. So future cast showing on Thursday not much really moving through here as we go through those morning rush hours for Thursday. So that cold air behind it though 26 but full sunshine Rob as we reach into the weekend. But wow is it going to be a cold start to that weekend overnight lows yeah. in the teens. That's the trade off we got to make I guess. <laughs> right. Thanks Mary Kay.